I check one, two, one, two. Oh yeah, we're good to go. What is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Joe Jones in the back for some more Pokemon Scarlet Viewers Choice Hardcore Nuzlocke game for you guys. Night number sixteen, Pokemon League time, baby. We're almost done, and then we're gonna do a little bit of post game, maybe. And I hope everyone's having a happy, healthy, wonderful day slash night. Whenever and wherever you guys are watching this video, commentary, and stream, and you are also in the force at all times, I had to make sure the audio works, and it does. And we are fantastic right now. In the last part, if I can remember correctly, part 15, we started the Pokemon League. Part 48 was preparing for the Pokemon League. Part 49 was starting the Pokemon League versus Rika versus Poppy versus Larry. And we lost Raven, the female Brax Caliper, due to me throwing against Larry, thinking that Brax Caliper is faster than the Star Raptor, Joey. Don't ever question and doubt the power of the speed of a Star Raptor again. So, yeah, unfortunately. And my beautiful Izzy takes the Pokemon test in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX because that is our next playthrough. And after we finish Scarlet, we're going to start another Hardcore Nuzlocke. And my goal, if possible, is every month to get one or two. Depending on how long or short the games are. Because, you know, all Pokemon games are different. Um, but yeah. Let's, uh, let's see. I like how my announcements work for stream cord. Fucking good. Alright, part 50 Pokemon League again. So Pokemon League again, pretty much. Um, make sure you guys follow me and sub to me at everything I do to be updated with everything. We have Twitch at JoeJoyN3. We have Twitter at JoeJoyN3. We have TikTok at JoeBoston3. We have YouTube at JoeChart and JoeJoyN3. Make sure you guys actually want to action. Before we begin, we lost a lot of people this month. And I apologize for not doing a video for all these beautiful people, these beautiful legends, and beautiful animals. I'm going to dedicate the entire stream for tonight. And always, of course, to the people that we lost for the month of January. I'll do my one minute moment of silence starting now. All right, let's do it. Please, God, God bless all the people and all the animals. Take care of them. Have for me. God bless my God's souls, everyone that we've lost. Rest easy, young legends. I will do my best to make everyone happy, smile, laugh, proud of my ability. We're in here. <clears throat> it's going to be a hell of a journey. Um, What I remember is that since we lost Brax Caliper, I swapped and put Bear Tick for now. Um, I don't have a bear tick. Hello. Oh my goodness gracious, bear tick. You know why? I never use one. Figure that out. Oh, give me one minute. I need a picture for the goon. Bear tick. Okay. Perfect. Okay. A little bit nervous, I won't lie. 
Um, <sighs> my boy um, Hassel is next. Um, but we're at 11 deaths because I sell all eight badges, 50 rolled, all five Titans defeated, and all five teams are basically cleared out. Level cap is 61. If we go above the level, we're allowed because we already entered the Pokemon League at the proper level or lower on my first attempt. Without further ado, let's do it. And I am fucking scared. Alright guys, um, how do I do this now, uh, okay, let me look at the team, um, oh yeah, how do I forget, I gotta, I gotta give you guys my quick, I'm gonna give you guys a quick team recap of my beautiful sex single team that I got going here for you guys, first of all, my starter Pokemon, the boss himself, the leader of the pack, my starter, we have Tizzy the male male Scarada at level 62. Grass Dark type with a terror type of grass with the miracle seed. Next up we have Vader. God bless him, God to Vader. Oh, it's Vader time! WB Hall of Famer, the boss himself. The male Pyra, level 63 fire, normal type with a terror type of fire with dimensional. Next up we have Magnet. The Magnezone at level 63, electric seal type of type of steel with light clay. Next up we have Aquaman, the male Vaporeon, level 63, pure water type of type of water with the mist uh with the Nevermelt Ice, never mind. Or Mystic Water depends on one, I'm feeling. Next up we have Ivy, the female Sylvia on level 62, pure fairy type with type of normal with the leftovers. And last one is we have a Chew. Back on the team, the newly fully evolved Bear Tick at level 61, pure ice type with a terror type of ice with the silk scarf. Um, I might just give him the Nevermelt Ice as well. Um, just because I know I have another one, I know I do. Okay, I was gonna say. Because in this game, you can get more than one of the same item, so I'm not having that as considered cheating. Um, because you're allowed to get multiple copies. Um, alright. Now, that's my recap. So now this is part 50, Pokemon League. But before that, your boy gotta pee, so I'll be right back. I count my headset. Hello, hello? Alright. I don't know why it's bugged out like that. I hope you guys didn't hear me taking a piss. Um. Sorry, if you did. Okay. Got this fucker now, my boy. I mean, uh, this goon. Uh. Hassle. Uh. I don't know. Dragon types always intimidate me uh, for hardcore Nuzlocke because sometimes I throw and it irritates me that I do that. Obviously, I don't do it on purpose. It just happens and I fucking dislike that. Um, okay, let me look at this team. 
He has three physical attackers, two special attackers. Okay. Um, ice is needed here. Um, this is freaking hard. I'm not going to lie. Anyone here? Um, shit. Mm, that moves a threat. Ah, I had a plan, but it's not going to work now. Harder sauce. Alright, uh, Joey, what do I do here, bro? Um... Bear Tick or Aquaman first? Who has more special defense? Oh. Well, Aquaman should be first. Precisely. Um... Yeah. Pretty much, I am fucked. Um, I'm gonna hope for the best. Um, let me see. Does he have anything to hurt me? He can hurt grass types. Oh no, he can hurt grass types. No. Let me see the box. Hold the phone. We have other members for a reason here, Joey. Um, we do have Donut. We do have Donut with Play Rough. Um... No one else really gonna help here, right guys? Yeah, I don't really see anyone else helping in this battle. Actually... <laughs> Philip Pew does have the Toxic Protect combo. What's your higher stat? <laughs> um, to be honest, Tizzy's not gonna help in this battle at all. And I don't want to chance my starter. You guys feel me? Uh, it's not worth doing that. Never was, never will be. Um, I'm gonna put Dona back on the team then. Um, what was I gonna put on Donut? Oh, I, I, I know. Do I have it here? Or is someone else holding it? Wide lens. Boost accuracy, yes. For play rough. Okay. Alright, I want to see your moves real quick. Uh, cause we don't really... Actually, priority baby doll eyes wouldn't be bad. Because technically speaking, we don't need, uh... Double edge. I know it's weird having baby doll eyes and charm. But... It's gonna help, trust me. Um... Uh, but yeah, I want to say this is the team we're going with. Um, we have super effectiveness, which is good. Uh, we have the power here, and um, I think we're going to be alright. Um, can I set up with you-know-who? Actually, I can. Well, it depends what move he goes for. Fuck. Um, do I go for a light screen first, or reflect? He mostly has physicals, though. But... I wanna... Hmm... I wanna say I'll be fine with Aquaman starting. I just hope I'm making the right decision here, guys. I'm terrified. Um... Okay. Um. Yeah, I think we're good here. Alright, so this is Verse Hassel. I spell this man's name. Who knows? Um. I spelled it right. Excellent. Verse Hassel. Uh, everyone wish you luck. I'm uh, gonna hope for the best here. Got my beautiful Izzy's hat on. Evie, because she's Evie, not Pikachu. My beautiful Izzy. She's so wonderful. And she's my good luck charm. I want to still be okay here. I have baby doll eyes. Charm to lower physical attackers. 
Uh, technically speaking, I can start with Magnet then and go for the light screen and then swap into Aquaman. Uh, I think Aquaman. I'm just gonna go, oh my god. Ready for his leave for? Yes. I was, of course, absolutely certain you would make it to me eventually. Young sprouts truly do grow with astounding speed, yes? But I never for a moment imagined we would be facing each other so soon. Now teachers do these to guide students and aid their growth. I think I shall be I shall forget my role as a teacher for a moment. And wield all my might for the sole purpose of defeating you. I am Hassel, the dragon guarding the final forces of the elite test. Prepare to learn firsthand how the fiery breath of ferocious battle feels. I couldn't like word that right in my head. Here we go. Do it. Do challenge by Hassle the Elite Four. Come at me, bro. Let's do this. Battle start. Show me everything you've learned. I shall face you with my full strength. All right, we have Hassle, the fourth and final Elite Four member for the Pokemon League. He has a powerful team of five, a Dragon type user of the Paldaren region. He starts off with a Noivern at level 60, Flying Dragon type with Infantry ability, so negates abilities. Or ignores abilities. Rockables Air Slash, Dragon Pulse, Super Fang, and Hyper Voice. I kind of want to scout him here since he does not have a setup move. That's what I'm going to do. I'm curious what he's trying to go for here so that I know. Fucking knew it. Fucker! Fucking prick. Now I can do. I have to do it. Fuck! Oh! It was half HP. Fucker. The quad weak. Get out of here. There was Noivat. Noivern. Hello. One down, four to go. That's a biz. Dragalge. At level 60, poison dragon type with poison points ability. So, you have a 30% chance to get poisoned if you inflict physical contact to it. Rock and move sludge bomb, dragon pulse, hydro pump, and thunderbolt. Now he's going for the thunderbolt here. Guaranteed. I'm gonna scout just in case. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty confident he is. I knew it. Fucker. Alright, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I'm playing this battle calmly. I'm not I'm not stressed, I'm not overthinking. Like I'm done with that nonsense, bro. I'm done. Okay. Going for Thunderbolt, correct? We swap into Magnet. There we go. Air Pro played. Light screen instantly. Oh, we all beat it! Woo! Go! Fuck me! <laughs> I'm getting too hyper. Okay. He has two more hydro pumps now. That's gonna do nothing. I lied, I couldn't get to crit! What do I do against this thing? I just thought about that now. A chew? Yeah, we have a school crash. One more hydro pump. Thought of an idea. Oh, we all speeded. Hello. It started to snow. The hell out of here, bro. Get this thing out of here. Good night. There goes Dragalge. Two down, three to go.
Next up is his Haxorus at level 60. Pure Dragon type of Mulberg ability, so negates abilities. Rock with Dragon Claw, Crunch, Iron Head, and Rock Tomb. He has super effective moves, that's why. What a fucker. Clone. That's what I thought about. How come I didn't think of that again? There goes Hacks at 3 down 2 to go. Now you, uh, my speed is doubled. Next up is his Flapple level 60. Grass Dragon type with ripe, Ripens ability. Ripens berries and doubles their effects. Oh gosh. Rock with Dragon Rush. Seed Bomb, Air Lace, and Leech Seed. There goes Flapple, 4 one to go. Only a little more until you pass. Don't let up. Here comes the starter. Here's Ace, his Brax Caliper. I had one before. At level 61, Dragon Ice up with Thermal Change ability. Thermal Change boosts the attack set by 1 when you're hit by a fire move. And you cannot be burned, which is good because you're a physical attacker. Rockwell's Icicle Crash, Brick Break, and Glaive Rush with a Terror type of Dragon, so he'll lose his Ice type in here. Ooh, super effective. This is neutral. Oh, well, because he's part Ice right now. But he's gonna trust the lies right now. Let's see who's faster. Let's go! We're allowed to trust like this important battle. You get it, cut the polar bear. Oh. Fucking good. Let's go, you. Come, ogre dragon, and take a terror jewel as your crown. Not afraid of you, bro. Well, we know how to speed it. Oh, good night. Please? Yes! There goes Brad Scalper. Five down, no more to go. Heck yeah. Be hassled the Elite Four. And a true good 62. Nice too. The mighty dragon has been felled. All right, well, that is the Elite Four down. Four down, no more to go, but four down, one more to go for the Pokemon League. You really did it. Oh, wow. Huh. V Vandaba! Because uh, he's, uh, he's ripped off into dad. I'm, I'm so proud of you. Ba -ba -ba Vandaba! Just like my son, Richtofen. Edward Richtofen. Sorry about this, show. We, we know that you love zombies, and uh, we love Easter eggs, and we're happy to bring you this Easter egg. But the old man can get like that sometimes. Oh, wonderful. Hey, pass. Oh, gosh. Our fearless commander, the final opponent. Champion of the Poldaren region, Champion Gita. <gasps> Did I get healed free of charge? My goodness gracious. Okay, well, as for his hassle, um, we actually did really good. Like, that was a really good battle. I'm not going to lie to anyone here. Um, oh, man. Alright, I got to prepare. Oh, give me one minute. Oh, my gosh. That was terrifying. Not really, but I uh, got a little bit cocky. Oh, but it prevailed. Okay. Now... We need Tizzy, of course. 
I didn't swap team member. Well, picture, did I? I apologize. Uh, it's okay. I mean, I only put, um... Uh, donut. Um... Because, um... You know, uh, for weakness, um, stuff. I don't even know what the hell I'm saying, I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, that's, uh, that's that. Hmm. Hey guys, I gotta strategize. Um, let me see, what do I do here, actually? I would like to set up with Magnet, but she has Reflect. And then that would that would screw everything up for me. Not really, but it will at the same time. Okay, well, Champion Gita is a mixed user. Um, um, the good part is she has a lot of mutual weaknesses. And I know I'm strategizing a lot here because I'm a sweaty fuck. But, um, it won't be a JoJo93 beautiful playthrough if I don't sweat like a little bitch. Um, or, you know, the sweaty fuck that I am. Um, okay. So I'm trying to thank one Pokemon for each of her Pokemon. Um, How do I do the? All right, so the first Pokemon is critical here. I want to. I want to say Tizzy would help right away. Are you gonna get the black glasses actually, Tizzy? Um. Okay. And then what would that bait out? It all depends what it baits out next. Alright, hold on. I need a... Do I have a dark type move? Well, I have a dark... T Why well, I do, I have Tizzy. Um... If it comes down to that. Um... Hmm... I guess it's... Hmm... But is that hold on, is this the team I want though? And her ace is a threat. Do I need Sylvia? Hold on, do I need Sylvia in this battle? I have to think bef like I don't want to get ahead of myself. I need to think does each Pokemon benefit? I mean I don't have a lot of members to choose from anyway. Um so I'm a little bit safe, kind of. Um, fuck. I'm sorry guys, give me one minute. I need to really think about this, because this is very scary. All right, technically speaking, I know I said I wasn't going to swap members, but I had to swap... Um, I had a swap because I lost a Pokemon. I lost Brax Caliper, so I swapped that with Brax Caliper with a Chew. Technically speaking, this should be the team of six I entered the league with. I mean, the champion with, because that's the team I started with. Besides, of course, you know, I lost Pokemon. I know I did one swap earlier, but I didn't swap to that Pokemon or use it, so technically I saved myself. Um. So, now I'm debating. If I should just go in with this team or swap, because not really to swap, to be honest. I know I have Toxic Protect with Pepe Le Pew. Don't get me wrong, it does help. Um, because Toxic is 100 accurate when when a Poison type uses it, which is what he is. I have Protect just for chip damage. Um.
Oh. Cause I wouldn't mind swapping Ivy for um armor. Cause fighting is very good against her. She has let's see, special physical, 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 special. So she has four physical attackers and two special attackers. Majority of this game is physical. I don't know why, but it is. Not have a I don't have a problem with it. I'm just saying. Hmm. So is that my goal? Is that my plan? Is that what I want to do? I'm scared about the types again with Vader. That's my only problem, and I don't have another. I don't have another fire type. Uh, well, I do. I have uh, chicken with flare blitz, technically speaking. But I could also pretend I, never, I don't have any Pokemon, and then enter the battle with these. Um, because this is a fantastic team, I'm not gonna lie, anyone here. Let me just double check the moves. Um. The superpower is gonna help. Um. Alright, so I'm fully healed except uh, flower tricks. I'm gonna give an ether. Um. My beautiful Tizzy here. That's not an Ether Joey. There it is. Become a sweaty fuck. Alright. Do I want Discharge or do I want Volt Switch? The Volt Switch will allow me to get chip damage, but Discharge, you do have a 30% chance to cause paralysis. Um, so I guess we're good here. But do I need this though? The answer actually is no. You're gonna get the muscle band actually. Or the black belt. Do I have muscle band though? Hold on. I feel like someone has it on. Yep, I knew it. Okay, I think Hariyama has it on. You do, okay. Alright guys, um, I guess this is the team we're going with. Um... Yeah. Ready to face the final test of Champion Assessment? Yes, I am. Okay, this is verse Champion Gita. Make sure I spell her name right. With two E's, Joey. Champion Gita. Welcome, Joey. It gives me great joy that you managed to make it all the way to the pinnacle of the Pokemon League. The final test is a battle against me, the top champion. To pass, all you need to do is win. Simple as that. But before we get started, I should apologize for one thing. And what is that? <laughs> Excuse me. You see... I have a trait that some might say is inappropriate for the League of Chairs women. Wait a minute, it's a PG stream! How dare you! I am utterly incapable of holding back when it comes to Pokemon battles. Maybe that's why nobody's passed this test recently. It's been a bit of a problem, to be honest. 
But you, you might manage something wonderful like Champion Mona did. So are you ready for final test? I want you to true measure of your talent. All right, so for Champion Gita of the Poldaren region, she has a powerful team of six, and she's a Pokemon League champion. I do hope you can defeat me and become a champion yourself. Oh, I do too, actually. She starts better off with a Espetra at level 61. Pure Psychic type opportunist ability. So if you lower any of its stats, it will get plus one, right? Or plus two. Oh, if any of... Oh, never mind. If any of my stats get boosted... Uh, its stats get boosted as well by the same. So if I use Bulka, get plus one attack and defense. Espetra will get plus one attack and defense. Pure Psychic type... Rocking the moves, Luminia Crash, Dazzle Gleam, Quick Attack, and Reflect. There's no way you outspeed me. There goes that Spectro. One down, five to go. I'm probably saying that wrong. That's it. I knew you could do it. Let's go, Tizzy! Yes, that was a correct decision in the situation. Please continue. Tizzy's built me all the way. I will sacrifice anything for my Tizzy. Oh, three level up, 63, 64, and 63. Um, for Tizzy, Vader, and Ivy, respectively. Next up is her Go Go at level 61, pure grass with Sap Sippers ability. It will get plus one attack if you hit with a grass type move. Rock Bulls Horn Leech, then Headbutt, Play Rough, and Bulk Up. So she's trying to go for a Play Rough here, I believe. Um, wait. She has bulk up. I can't chance anything. Okay, I'm gonna get some chip damage with um U turn, correct? Yes. That's how you could do it. Alright, it's going for a play rough, correct? Are we confirmed? The answer is yes. Vader, we need you. Okay, I did not expect that. Right though, good night. You're cocky. There goes Go Go. Two down, four to go. A third of her team defeated. Magnus 64, nice too. We had the lock on Zap Cannon combo. Um, it always causes paralysis. But it's the accuracy, that's what you need lock on. Lock on guarantees that you won't miss. Um, okay, next up is her Avlog at level 61. Pure Ice have own temple ability, so you can lower its attack stat or make it confused or infatuated. Rock was Avalanche, Crunch, Earthquake, and Body Press, that's why. But it's opposite gender. And uh, even though the mention is up, will I one shot? No, right? I don't have immunity for ground. I mean, I have resistance. I have no one I can eat that up. Oh! A crit! I don't know if that mattered! Truly, there's a blow. That deserves a stand and ovation. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you very much. There goes Avlog, three down, three to go. Half her team is defeated. Aquaman goes to 64, nice too. Next up is her King Bandit. At level 61, Dark Seal type with Supreme Overlord as ability. When the Pokemon enters battle, its attack and attack are boosted by 10% for each ally in the party that's she's been defeated. So the most is um 50%. To the end of team of six, and you come out last. A Dark Steel type, rocking the moves Iron Head, Cow Tau Cleave, Zen Headbutt, and Stone Edge. What does that do again? The dark type move, 10 pp, base power of 85, 101 accuracy. The user slashes the target after Cohen to make the target let down its guard. This attack never misses. Ah. Well, we had the mention all up. We're gonna keep going for Flamethrower. There goes King Bandit. 
Four down, two to go. Two thirds of her team defeated. Next up is her Veluza. A level 61. Water Psychic type with Moberg's ability, so it negates abilities. Rock and Moves, Aqua Jet, Liquidation, Psycho, Cut, and Ice Fang. Now, will it go for an Aqua Jet? I know I can live one. I don't know what I'm up to with Flamethrower. I know it's really high right now because I mentioned them at least at plus three. Um, let me just look. Hold on, Joey. Let me not get cocky. There's no point in getting cocky in this important battle. You know what I mean? You feel me? Hold on. There's a special attack away in the back. Uh, well, she has no super effective moves on me. Magnet, we need you. Okay. Reflect immediately. I know it's an outspeed. Oh no! Go for liquidation, correct? Um, if I go into Tizzy... Oh, I, oh, I have Water Absorb. I have a plan. The boss has a plan, don't worry. Vault in Veloza! Joey has a plan! Oh, it ignores abilities! <laughs> um... Don't worry, we have Charm. Of course, a crit. Oh, good quit. Poor thing. Oh, you're minus six now. Reflected three more turns. Oh, is this wise? I, I get the immunity. Oh, I wanted to get the light screen up. That's why. Oh, I'm scared about uh, her starter. Of course. Thank you, Magnet. Go on, Tizzy. I know you can do it, matey. I resist that. A better way to end the Pokemon League would press Liza with my starter, the one who's been with me throughout my entire journey. Who never let me down. Who carried the team? Who saved the team? Courtesy of Izzy and Tig. Good night, Volson Baluza. There goes Baluza. Five down, one more to go. Gonna quit. That's it. I know you can do it. I lose my Dark Typhon. Not a big deal, though. Next up is her starter, her Glamora. He don't think you won just yet. At level 62, rock poison type with toxic debris ability. Um, scatters poison spikes at the feet of the opposing Pokemon when it takes damage from physical moves. Rock will lose Terra Blast, Sludge Wave, Earth Power, and Dazzle Gleam with a Terra type, but Rock will lose his poison type in.
need to light that guy's old trainer, Glamora. Oh, oh my gosh, this is it! This is it. I have a super effective stab. With the miracle seed. Oh no, I have black glasses. Oops. Oh, I have a stab anyway. There goes Gomora. Six down. No more to go. That's good though. Could if I inflict spice, toxic spice will be regular poison and badly poison. That's pretty good. And you can negate that with a steel type, I believe. And defeat a top champion, Gita. You go on. You go beyond my imagination so easily. Such a woman power, such amazing skill. It seems Paldera has gained another wonderful trainer to be proud of. Congratulations, it's my honor to call you champion, Joey. Thank you, ma'am. I will not let you down. Only losing one Pokemon, that's not, that's not bad. Because I sold, I, now if I could go back in time for that battle, I'm curious if the Ice Shard would have uh, KO'd the star after. And I guess I'll never know. That's okay. Cutscene. Or not. <gasps> Joey, Joey, it's the Mona. How do you know, Nimona? Yes, I did it. Yes, yeah, gonna be the re best rivals for life. Yes, Tomaya. All right, you know rivals do better. Bow their absolute hearts out. Out behind your house, the treasure eatery, Mezagoza. That's what we set up on our journey together. Oh my gosh. Alright. Well, that's the good part. I am saving immediately. I like how there's no credits because this is not the end of the game, technically speaking. Um, that is versus champion Gita in a fantastic battle by me. And that's going to be part 50, Pokemon League, or the rest of Pokemon League, versus Hassel and champion Gita. Part 51 is preparing. Got to prepare for champion Nomona. Actually, no. Actually, I want to be fair with everyone. Her team is 66. Um, And to be fair, I wanted to do the levels kind of in order. Now, technically, we're supposed to do the league first, and I did. So I wanted to do Arvin, Director Clavel, and Penny first. Then... Nimona's. We have four important battles left for this playthrough. Whatever happens, I have to accept it. Um, but the good part is now that these are separate battles, um, I can swap any time now. And it's not cheating because it's not Pokemon League. So that's good at least, right? Alright, so now that the Pokemon League is done, um, I'm going to scout my team out. And Arvin is first on our list, right? 
I want to say yes. Uh, Path of Legends. Gotta fight my boy, Arvin boy. Thank you, Nurse Joy, for healing me. I am a champion now. All right, let's see my boy Arvin real quick. All right, looking at his team. Oh my gosh! Actually, looking at his team, four of his Pokemon out of six, so we can't fight him. Um. Okay. Okay. Based on what I'm looking at here, I'm keeping Tizzy. Um. Vader. Uh, Magnet is my screen user, so I always have to keep Magnet out. Um, I think Ivy I can keep here. Well, actually, a Chew is good here too. Excuse me. Um, I think Aquaman is the only one that I'm looking at that might not really help in this battle. So I think I'm going to swap Aquaman for armor. Um, because I need the fighting. Hold on. Hold on. Let me think this through. Let me not get... Hold on. I don't want to get cocky. That, that's... You see, that's the thing, though. Because I, I tend to get cocky. <laughs> Excuse me. That's not good. No, armor... Hold on. He has light screen, too. All right, let me let me fly somewhere. It, it it feels weird that there's no audio here, or there's no sound. I guess you could say, except the wind. Uh, I mean, I am playmaker, so you know, seize the wind, playmaker. Oh, my house first. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Um. His whole team is physical, pretty much. That is insane. That is fucking crazy. Okay. Uh. No, 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 no. All right, yeah. So Aquaman is not gonna help. Oh. Um. Would a poison type help? Let me see. Uh, against one. Wait a minute. Barbecue has earthquake, doesn't he? Or am I delusional? We have earthquake. Um. Na, 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 na. Does armor else? Actually, I might. Ooh. All right, armor's joining. Mm-hmm. Actually, Pepe Le Pew can help here, too. I need um. Oh, this is actually pretty rough. Oh, shit. All right, hold on, guys. Getting ahead of myself here. Do I need Vader? Actually, I might not need Vader in this battle. Um. Yeah, I don't think I need Vader in this battle. Now that I think about it, yeah, I'm not. I'm not using Vader. Maybe 
be Pepe Le Pew. Um, okay. Let me let me see one more time, guys. Hold on. I'm just, I'm just looking at my team. Uh, oh, I have Tizzy. Hold on. I'm a clown. Uh, but it's it's my boss. If that's the threat, I guess Ivy, right? No, that's a physical attacker. Shit. I mean, I have options though. I really want to use Ski because I had Lead Seed, but it's like I have to, it has to be in the moment though. It, it can't just like I can't just use it just to use it. It has to be like I have to do it. Do I want to do it though? Do I want that? I guess this is a team, Joey. Black belt. All right, Joey. Um, I can't think of anything else. Like. I think I'm good with this team. <sighs> Hold on. I have to keep looking real quick, guys. Hold on. Yeah. All right. I'm using Vatham again because uh, that's what uh, coffee and caffeine does to me. So I'll be right back. Alright guys, this is it. Okay. I'm gonna have protect one, two, three, four. Four of them do that's not too bad. Uh are the moves I'm liking yes, yes. Priority can I need that. Yes. Okay. I wanna say we're good. Everyone wish me the best of luck, and this is it. Hold 
Hold on, guys. Base mommy inbound, see what I'm calling it. PJ, what's up? I'm shooting my wonderful nice and safe, my guy. I want to show in the Discord, mate. We have uh, four more important battles, and we're done with this playthrough. And I'm terrified. Uh. Wait a minute. What I thought the battle off with? Hold on. Oh yeah, <laughs> I'm a soul. Oh, Rocky helmet's a thing. I forgot I had that. Um, that's gonna help because his team is physical attackers. All oh, the rain stopped. Nice too. I have close combat, right? Yeah, I do. Come on, Joy. Gosh. All right, guys. Um, so that's gonna be part fifty-one. Uh, preparing for Arvin. Actually, yeah. Part fifty-two now is versus Arvin. I'm terrified. It's gonna be electric facts. Everyone is loving mommy as a heel. So just imagine when she turns face. Oh shit. I'm good. Um I'll wait until I see um I see you on. Seriously, you beat me here? Well, this is the lab. I used to come here to play all the time when I was a kid. There's a better there better be a good reason for us calling us here like this. Let's find out. Oh, she does this work. She never comes home. I don't have a single memory of her as a kid. But boss is the only one who's there for me. Anyways, open now. Go on in. What's the first Arvin? I'm gonna get this over with. Scared. Hudson, that means donut time. <laughs> Can't wait, facts. Me too. I need your help. Rot well. I need mania now, damn. Area zero. Need the Scarlet Book.
Uh oh. Is she gonna bring back her own theme song? Uh, who we talking about? Mommy? I'm not sure. Would be nice. <clears throat> I never know. If she's face, maybe. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I'm hungry. Mommy barely. That's your woman, bro. Go for her already. Stop. You already know what to say. We planned this out already. <clears throat> Alright, Joey, outside. We're gonna have a poem about to see if we're ready. Oh! It's terrifying. <laughs> bro, bro, Raggy. We have a welcome on rattle. If I sound high, I'm not. Um. <clears throat> I don't Arvin. My boss this! Come and join my team, matey! <laughs> my boss this, why? Alright, are you ready for Pokemon Battle, Joey? Yes, I am, matey! Excellent, you're ready to do right, my boss this? <laughs> yep, my boss said he's ready. Uh, excuse me, you're about my boss this? Okay, yeah, I can see why you'd be worried. But my buddy here has been burst with energy. You'll never know it. He was so weak just a little while ago. Won't leave me alone. Always whining at me, wanting to battle you and your Pokemon. It's been a long time, and I nearly forgot, but he always did love to battle. Even if we lost to Student Council Girl, that battle fanatic won. Anyway, my point is there's no need to worry. We're a brand new Arvin and Mabustive, and we're feeling Arteris, or maybe a Bachelor's. Oh, I get it, because Urban Mythicus. Let's give you a taste of what we can do. Alright, here we go. Rob Battle 2 against my boy Arvin as the champion. Let's go, my boy. The Pokemon I met during out one hunt for the Urban Mythical. All stars here, every one of them. Yes, yeah, a friendly strike. Every Pokemon he uses here, we've met when he teamed up with us against the five Titans. And then Mabostev is his ace, of course. Alright, he starts about off. He has a powerful team of six. Arvin, a mixed user of the Poldaren region. One of our best friends throughout our playthrough. He starts about off with a greeting at level 58. Pure normal type with Cheek Pouch's ability, so it can activate the use of a berry earlier. Rock and Blue's Bullet Seed. Body Slam, Psychic Fangs, and Earthquake. Here we go. Fake out, baby. We're allowed to trust like this important battle. Real speed it! <gasps> there goes Greed it, one now, five to go. That's how you can do it. Ooh. 
Next up is a Skull Villain at level 60. Grass, Fire type with Chlorfield's ability, so it doubles its speed in the sun. Rock moves Fire Blast, Energy Ball, Zen Headbutt, and Crunch. Oh, he's going for the Zen Head... Uh, yeah, Zen Headbutt. Uh, I do have an immunity here. <clears throat> what was my plan for this? He's gonna go for Super Effective Zen Headbutt, right? He has to. He has to, right? I'm immune, I'm dark! <laughs> Let's go, Pepe Le Pew! Oh, I think this is debut battle, isn't it? Maybe, I'm not sure. Yes, get pro played! Let's go, Pepe! Oh, we all speed it? Toxic, baby! Okay, I didn't expect that. He's just like, wow, this guy's a sweat. Well, we know we all speed it. There goes Skull Villain, two down, four to go, third of his team gone. Tizzy Goodsill 64, nice too. Leaf Storm. That's special. Nope. Next up is his Gargantua at level 60. Pure rock type with purifying salt as ability. Uh, it protects itself and allies from status conditions and halves damage taken by ghost type moves. Rock moves Stone Edge, Earthquake, Body Press, and Stealth Rock. So, what are you trying to go for here? Super effective Earthquake, right? Yeah. Should I scout? He has no setup moves, right? No, but well, he has Stealth Rock. Will that work if I use Protect? Scout anyway. No! Fucker. Could have poisoned it. Damn it, Harvey. Alright, he's going for Earthquake guaranteed now. I going to Tizzy here? Oh, I left the black glasses on. Fuck. Will Flower Trick one shot? Physical though. Oh shit. Yeah, this is scary, guys. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. Alright, Earthquake is no matter what coming out here. Like, that's guaranteed. Like, we already know this, right? So, we know Earthquake's coming out. We have Rocky Helmet. What's my defense? Oh wow, we're frail. Um, 
can't use Magnum quad weight to ground. Um, I mean, I like I said, I resist. But I'm not. But then, what would it, what would it go for then? I can see it sends a grass Pokemon. Stone Edge, right? Stone Edge will be its yeah. Stone Edge will be its best bet here. Stone Edge. That's gonna one shot me. I'm frail. That's how you turn out. Out now. Body press. Why? Oh, I'm part dark. Don't even answer that, guys. Don't answer that. All right, he's going for a fighting move here. Fighting, 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 fighting. I resist. There's no point. Armor, we need you. the same but then this is stab. So armor those gargantro that's it you can do it three down three to go half the team is defeated alright next up is his toad scroll at level 61 ground Grass type with Mystilium Might as ability. This Pokemon always acts slowly when using status moves, so moves last. But these moves can be unimpeded by the ability of the target. I don't know what that means. Um, it moves last in the speed bracket, though. So if it, um, Rocket moves, Power Whip, Earth Power, Spore, and Sludge Bomb. So if he wants to go for Spore here, he's gonna move last. Uh, I'm curious here. I'm gonna protect. See what he's going for. Power whip. Hmm. He's going for a power whip here. Power whip. Alright, it's going to Tizzy. By the old chance he goes for Spore, we have immunity. Because Grass Side can't put sleep with Powder Moves. Get Pro Played. By me. Alright, now we go for the U turn. That's it, you can do it. Dizzy. Okay. Alright, what would he go for in a grass type? Either Earth Power or Sled. This is a super effective Sledge Bomb here. So now we go into Pepe. La Pew! Now we go for um, uh, poison jab. It off speed. Ah, 
sorry, sorry, sorry. I am so sorry, Pepper Le Pew. Twelve deaths on the board. Everyone had their eyes closed, right? Pretty sure you guys did. What? 111? Oh, well, we know Tizzy outspeeds it. What? I'm so lost. This thing is fast. It goes close throw 4 down 2 to go. That's how you can do it. Alright, well we know who's coming out now, right? All three level ups for Ivy, Achu, and Armor. Level 64, 63, and 62. We get physical attackers left. Um, so we're going to Magnet here. My screen user. All right, next up is this Cloister. Hello, 59. Water Ice type with skill link ability. So if moves hit two to five times, it will always hit five times. Rock moves, Rock Blast, Ice Cold Spear, Liquidation, and Light Screen. My goal for right away. Shit. Yeah, he might go for the life stream right away. Alright, this is this is risky. Can't chance it. There goes Cloyster. Five down one to go. That's it, you can do it. Mountain Group 65 nice too. Here comes his ace, Mabostiv. Did he say anything? No? No, he's why I didn't. His starter has Mabostiv level 63. Pure Dark type when Terminus ability to lower your attack stat by one. With a terror type of Dark. Rock moves Crunch, Psychic Fangs, Fire Fang, and Play Rough. And we're allowed to trash life through this important battle. A sub your full recovery with a glow up. Time to trash life, my bosses. I'm terrified, hero boy. That's a stab crunch. Defense, baby. I'll be good. Going for crunch, correct? On the Ivy. Set the stage here. Psychic Fang breaks that. Oops. Oh, damn. Alright, I have to go for it again. Are right, you minus two now?
training. What? There's some recovery back. Minus five. I know it's over. I know, guys. I know. Call me a sweat. I know. Woo! I just realized Moonblast is super effective. <laughs> Minus six. All right. Oh, I forgot to switch. Um, my layout. I am so sorry. Well, nothing that matters because I lost my uh, skunk. Skunk thing. I didn't have a picture apparently, okay. Alright. And they go from Boston six down, no more to go. That's it, they can do it. Was that a crit? No. Alright. I beat my my rival, one of my best friends, Arvin, Rab Battle 2, at the lighthouse. When we first met. We were so close, my boss, so close. But Joey, thanks, little buddy. That's 13 that's oops. Damn it. We need two more people. <gasps> Maybe Penny? Alright. Path of Legends complete. Holy now. That's it. We get fully healed from the boss, thank you. Alright, that is 
Or 52 versus Arvin and I lost Pepe Le Pew by me throwing as always. R53 now is preparing again. Um, for uh, Director Claval. Claval, right? Mm. Oh, shit. Alright, um... Well, first and foremost, Pepe Le Pew, I am so sorry that I threw. Um, Alright, for now, we're gonna put Aquaman back, because that was the original team. Alright, let's see what my boy here has. Or his team varies depending on your starter, forgot. Um... Give me one minute, guys. Uh, let's see, he has... Oh, he's a mixed user. Never mind. Wow, he's mixed. Hmm. Okay. Alright, let's see. Oh. Okay, I can use my starter here. Okay. I'm keeping Tizzy, I'm keeping Magnet, I'm my screen user. Um, I want Vader back on the team. Yeah, I want Vader back on the team. Uh, I don't see myself using Ivy in this battle. Magnet's good here. Mm. Bait in here. Bait in. Okay, yeah, I don't see much of using armor. Armor is not gonna help here. So armor is done. Well, you know, for this battle, I mean. Uh. Kinda of scary, guys. Uh, what does uh, Vroom Vroom have? Uh, mm, would it help? Uh, not really. So I guess uh. Are you ski? Oh, give me grass immunity. Oh, I'm supposed to battle director first. Well, ah, it's based on level. It's okay. They're all just like a couple levels before each other. Um. Oh no, wait a minute, that's touch. Oh, I didn't think. Hold on, this is kind of scary now. Ah, shit. Okay, hold on, guys. D d oh, I didn't think it is true. Shit. I'm gonna use chicken. Um Do I really want the no held item on it? Um, 
the baiting. Do I want Pyroar? Yes, I do. What does chicken have? Hmm. Kaelin would help. I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm a minus attack nature. What else? What can I learn? Oh, really? Nothing. Oh, uh, wow. I, I guess. Wait, why do I have- hold on, why do I have bear tick out? Gotta be a reason. Oh, well I have backup for it. Yeah. Okay. One more time, hold on. You know what? Maybe I should use uh, Sylvie on here. Hold on. Hold on. Only if I have the move, though. Hold on. black glasses right is that what we want yes we do uh, yeah on Vaporeon Aquaman what do we want more we want mythic water we have our reasons though Let's do it. Alright, part 53 is preparing for Director Clavel. Alright, part 54 versus Director Clavel. Alright, guys. What's up, Joey? Director Clavel? 
Oh, come on, the name's Clive, remember? Actually, no. Time for me to bring this little performance to an end. Allow me to reveal my true identity. Aha! I knew it. I do apologize for deceiving you in my disguise. In true, the boy you knew as Clive was none other than director of Naranja Academy, Mr. Clavel. No way! The true identity of Casopia, the big boss the team saw, was me all along! For real? Honest to goodness. That was clever. So, Master Joey, now you know I'm the big boss, that means the one thing left to do, right? Face your one final show on the side at all. Alright, here we go. My boy! Alright, this is versus Director Clavel. He has a problem team of six, a mixed user of the Poldaren region, and the director of my academy, Narendra Academy. Let's do it. I am Kasapia of Team Star, which this battle will finally bring our first Team Star fall to an end. Alright, he's a probable team of six. He's also battle with a Orangaroo at level 60. Excuse me, I keep burping. Normal psychic type with inner focus ability, so cannot flinch. Rock moves Yawn, Dream Leader, Reflect, and Foul Play. Come on, Sizzy. There goes Rangaroo, one down, five to go. That's it, you can do it. <gasps> Vader is still 65, nice too. Next up is this Abomas Snow at level 60. Grass Ice type with no warning ability, so the snow activates immediately, so Ice types get plus one defense now. Rock moves Aurora Veil, Blizzard, Woodhammer, and Ice Shard. Oh. Oh no, if he goes Aurora Veil, I'm screwed. That's how they can do it. Damn, he's gonna go for Aurora Veil. Oh, oh, we might go for Blizzard. Blizzard and Mist in the hail. Vader, we need you. <laughs> we can go for Blizzard instead. No! He has Reflect and Light Screen now. Well, there goes a bomb until two down, four to go. A crit, nice suit. That is a third of his team defeated. He goes to 65, nice too. Next up is Gyarados at level 60, water flying type with intimidating ability. So we'll be at minus one attack. Arc will Aqua Tail, Crunch, Stone Edge, and Earthquake. So he's gonna go for Aqua Tail here. Uh oh, or Stone Edge. What would he go for? I don't know. Going to Magnet. No! Don't go for Earthquake! Okay. Oh my gosh. My heart. Alright, two more two more turns. Okay. Now he's gonna go for Earthquake. We have chicken here. Okay, good. Alright, now he's gonna go for Stone Edge, correct? <laughs> I can't keep swapping those, it'll take forever. I'll never win. Um. I, I can't need Aquaman for, uh. Ah, oh shit, I need for a starter. Shit. This is hard. Um. Damn it, I can't keep swapping. Cause I'm just gonna I'm gonna take unnecessary damage. He's going for Stone Edge no matter what, because I'm quad weak. So, so that's a fact already. And my Pokemon have low defenses. Oh my gosh. There's no way I lose to this man. 
Oh. So sorry, chicken. I don't have a safe switch in. Fuck! When the snow and the raw are all gone. I'm so sorry, chicken. I know that was foolish. Um, but I had no other safe switch in. So 14 deaths on the board. I hate doing that, but you have to you have to make sacrifices sometimes and it sucks. I have the tailwind up, so I should all speed, correct? There goes Gyarados, 3 down, 3 to go. That's how they can do it. <laughs> it's coming out now, fam. Next up, this is Poltergeist. At level 60, pure ghost type with weak armor ability. Every time you inflict damage to it, physical attacks um, will lower its defense stat and special defense stat by 1, or raise its speed by 2. I I outspeed it though. He's going for shell smash, isn't he? Oh, this is not good. Yeah, he's gonna go for shell smash here. Right? Yeah, he is. Or not. Ice cream? What was my plan, Tizzy? Tizzy, we need you. Oh, it was Ivy, wasn't it? That's okay. We're lost to Tressa because this, this is an important battle. These are the final three battles now. There goes Pulti guys, four down, two to go. Two thirds of the team gone. Defeated. That's it, you can do it. Next up, this is Amoongus at level 60, Grass Poison type with Effect Force ability. You have a 30% chance to have a status if you're able to be inflicted by it. Either poisoned, paralyzed, or asleep. Rock moves 4, Toxic, King Drain, and Hex. So, I, I'm not sure what you're going to go for here, I really don't. And I have 5 more turns to light screen, so I'm, I'm going to... Actually, I'm just going to U-turn out. Neutral. What would you do, right? I don't know. We're going to Vader. Vader time! Oh, same gender to rap. Good night. It was a Moongus 5 down, 1 to go. Here comes his starter! Ha! Huh, to think I, Casavia, would be backed into a corner like this. You have to start a strong near type of man. So if you chose Sprigatito, they'll have Skelders right now. 
At level 61, fire ghost up with blaze abilities to increase the fire timbers by 50%. If it's HP 30% or below, would it uh, tear a type of fire? So it becomes pure fire type. Rock and Shadow Ball, Torch Song, Earth Power, and Snarl. If you chose Quaxley, he'll have Meowskarada. A little 61 Grass Dark, but Overgrowth ability with Terra type of Grass. Rock and Moose, Shadow Claw, Flower Trick, Thunder Punch, and Play Rough. And if you chose Rococo, you will have a Coquavo, a level 61 Water Fire type with Torrent ability with Terra type of Water. Rock and Moose, Brick Break, Aqua Step. Aerial Lace and Ice Spinner. Okay. Now, he's gonna go for a ground move, correct? I'm putting him in minus one. Very well, seems I shall trust life my Pokemon. Alright, now he loses Ghost Typing. Yeah, minus one. Depends how much this does. Okay. Playing the save, going for it again. Got minus two now. One more turn to light screen. Okay. My goal is going to Aquaman. Let's do it. Thank you, Vader. Vader time. All right, Aquaman. Let's do it. Allow to press life for this important battle. All right, Aquaman. Let's finish this. Perfect stab with Mystic Water, it's like times three, and there goes Skildred, six down, and no more to go. Aquaman and Magnus to 65 and 66 respectively, double nice to Director Clavel in front of Naranja Academy, Mezagoza. How strong you have grown. Thank you, sir. All right, two more important battles left. Well now, Master Joey. You have grown quite splendidly over the course of your treasure hunt. I might actually Caspia. It's just Clive and Clavel. The goal. Yes, sir, I will. I will not let you down. Uh oh. I missed time. We get fully healed, thank you, sir. Alright, guys, that is part 54 versus Director Clavel, and I lost chicken, of course. Um, my female talent flame, my fortune, could I sell? Part 55 now is preparing again. But that battle went well, though. It's Director Clavel, so I can't, can't hate. Alright. All right, hold on guys. Um hold on. Mm 
-hmm. You have... Alright, pennies is mixed. Um, I'm debating. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, give me one minute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think this is the same I want. Um, I'm swapping Tau and Flame. Eh, I don't have a picture for the boss, of course I don't. I d <laughs> Never mind, I spelled it wrong. Okay. And then, when we swapping Fariyama, Sylveon? Alright, guys, that's uh. Alright, that's that. All right, now we have to look for items that we need. Um, uh, so, Dizzy needs the Miracle Seed back. Um, I was, hold on, while I, use, I need to see why I was using Witch Cash. Uh, one more time. Which cash I was using for one of two things. Yes, ground. Okay. Alright, guys. Um. I need the charcoal. If I even have it on me. I do. Yes, there you go. This is it. Oh my gosh! Alright team.
Alright guys, let's uh, let's fight the next trainer, shall we? One of my personal favorites in this game. Do I have to go again? Cool yard, right? Who's out front? Alright, that is preparing. Actually, never mind. Yeah, it's gonna be versus Penny. Never mind. Alright, bathroom time, and that's it. Alright guys, this is it. For those of you who don't know that this is an S tier like battle theme and one of my favorites of all time in all of Pokemon. Cassiopeia, Joey. <gasps> Hope to see a W buddy! Don, what's up? Welcome to my wonderful day and you're saying safe my guy. We're almost done. Two more important battles, mate. Thanks for coming. Also, solid team. Thank you, my guy. I had to keep swapping for every battle. Um, but yeah, you, you you know you know the, you know the drill, right? Always have to swap members. You know, light screen and reflect, protect, toxic. You know, immunities. You you know how I roll already. You know, big boss Cassiopeia. They were both me all along. When I saw you make a quick work of those team star lackeys outside the school that time, you see how pretty starful someone came to me. My skills let me get a hold of as many life points. I'm a kind of fan. As I once, I decided to use that to tempt you and to help me out. After the operation started, I keep I kept an eye on you as a member of the supply unit, and I had to bow the bosses on my behalf. And for the goal of defeating me and putting in an end to Team Star once and for all. But still, it's a part of me that wants Team Star to live on. I can't just roll over and let you win without putting up a fight. This is the final showdown. Are you ready? I'm ready. Thanks. Sorry to keep you. The letter of apology. You got this. Thank you, my guy. We have uh, one more battle left. After that. After this. Only challenge the battle, in my opinion, is Toro or Sada. True. Um, let's just say I'm kind of lazy to do that. I stop after the Mona. Uh, you know, I'm a clown. But yes, they are hard battles. I'm sorry. I love this theme. Matey! Allow me to do myself properly. I'm the big boss of Team Star. The name's Cassiopeia. No, Penny. Anyways, going to watch and learn. Thank you, Don, my guy. Oh, we have a wonderful stream, mate, and I'll be there. Now, bow down before the overwhelming might of Team Star's founder. I love this theme so much. You're challenged by Penny of Team Star. She has a powerful team of six at Mesagoza Dual Academy in the schoolyard. And my boy director Clavel is watching to record this battle because Penny wanted it. I won't hold back in this battle. I'll say two to Team Star's code. 
She has the Eevee Lucian. She's hunched off with a Umbreon, a level 62, pure dark type of synchronized ability. So any status you flick to it, it inflicts bounces back at you if you're able to get inflicted by that status. Rockable's Dark Pulse, Quick Attack, Baby Delize, and Psychic. Love this theme, Don. Yeah. I can live that. Come on now. There's nothing. It was on Brian. One down, five to go. I think you can do it. She has all the misses. Espeon. Vader goes to 66, nice too. Next up is her Flareon at level 62, pure fire type with flash fire's ability. Well, it, it gets fire immunity and increases attack type by one or heals HP. Let me see. Uh, oh, once activated, uses fire symbols to deal 1.5 extra damage for the next turn. Alright, rock and moves, flare blitz, quick attack, baby delight, and fire spin. I'm gonna scout. Fire spin. Alright, was it Aquaman or Barbecue that I was gonna use here? Aquaman. We need you. Izzy's son is a Flareon! But not this Flareon though. My Flareon. There you go, Flareon. Two down, four to go. A third of her team defeated. Next up is her Jolteon at level 62. Pure left type with quick speed ability. Uh, quick speed is boosted speed by one if it has a status condition or by 50%. Rock with Thunder, Quick Attack, Baby Delize, and Pin Missile. I want to scout out, just in case. Thunder, okay. <laughs> barbecue, we need you. I think this is Barbecue's debut, I'm not sure. Stand by for battle. Okay. Won't even work. I'm a minus one. There goes Jolteon. Two down, four to go. Oh, three down, three to go. I can't count. Half her team defeated. I think this is her Leafy on level 62, pure grass type with Leaf Guard ability. If the sun is out, it can't get any status condition afflicted to it. Rock with Leaf Blade, Quick Attack, Baby Delize, and Exeter. Vader, we need you. Leave you on four down, two to go, two thirds of the team defeated. Barbecue is still 62, nice too.
Except it's her own Vaporeon as well. At level 62. Pure Water type with Water Absorb ability. So it gets Water Immunity. And increases HP if hit by Water Move. Rock Pulse, Hydro Pump, Quick Attack, Baby Delize, and Aurora Beam. Uh, should I swap for the heck of it? Is that fun? I'm gonna go for Hydro Pump no matter what. I know we need you. That's fine. It's a life you know, baby. I think you can do it. I'm good. I'm doing it. Well, lots of trust life for this important battle. Electric typing now. There goes Vaporeon. Five down one to go. I think they could do it. TZ goes to 66. Nice, Sue. Here comes her starter, her ace. I can't fault you and your battle skills at all. No wonder the boss is fell at your hands. Thank you, ma'am. Is her Sylveon level 63 pure fairy type with Q Charm ability with her type of fairy Q Charm? You have a 50% chance to become infatuated. Or 30, no, 30% chance to come back if you flick physical contact. Rock Moon Moonblast, quick attack, be able to lie, then Shadow Ball. Time to trust life, shine bright like a starry sky and become who you really want to be. Battle. Or not. I think you could do it. Shadow Ball. Neutral? No, resist that. No, neutral, neutral. Magnet, finish this battle for me, matey. Real Sylveon, six down. No more to go. I think you could do it. Armor with 63, and that's Penny. And Izzy's daughter is Sylveon, but my Sylveon. That's it, Penny. Ivy. It's finally over, guys. Son. That was recorded. Oh damn. Time to E after that battle.
Oh, damn. Team Star. Hasta la vista, Casapian. Hello, Penny. Wow. Can't see, but I'm tearing right now. Is it one more important battle? The director is angry. <laughs> Community service. Great. <sighs> okay. That is R55 versus Penny. And finishing Team Star. Operation Starfall. Hold on, I'm actually gonna go to the office really quick. Before I timestamp again, just in case. I, I thought I'm just curious what happened. Hold on. Let's we'll see what the director has to say.
no, Penny. What did you do? I didn't read what it said. It went too fast. I knew it, meet up with Penny, okay, so we're not done yet. Hasta la vista. TM169 Draco Meteor? Oh my gosh. Oh, that's it. Starfall Street complete. Alright, now that's part 55. First penny and finish an operation team starfall. Alright guys, one more important battle. <laughs> Fantastico. Okay, now this is where it gets scary. This is where it gets good. Okay. <clears throat> I'm definitely using my starter for this one. Okay. Wait, hold on. Okay. I also have... Okay. Do I need... Um... Do I need Aquaman? Hold on. No. Mm. Actually, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. She has five physical attackers and one special attacker. Oh my gosh. That is ridiculous. Uh. 
trying to find out. Um, Fluffy can help. I'm just scared about her starter, that's why. Um, unless I do use it before I have the water immunity. I feel threatened. Do I need Ivy then? No, right? No, I don't actually. Do I keep Aquaman or do I keep Barbecue? His barbecue can help too. Barbecue can help. Because I have earthquake. Actually no, actually no, earthquake's not gonna help. Never mind. Um yeah, I guess this is a team. Alright, so part fifty six is Namona. Versus Namona 6. You yeah, don't know what? <gasps> the Peter might go up to the final battle, mate. I'll tackle the final battle. Scared <sighs> though, but I mean, I got it. Yeah. Switch the layout again. Air tick is back. That's the team, yep. What are these items we need? Um, for I. Hmm. Gotta look one more time. Um. Oh, I do have armor again. Oh, yeah, I have a ground move. Yeah. And then her starter is the threat. Um, I have water immunity. Her starter. And I just need a safe switch in. Okay, so I, I have type advantage here. What? Alright, here we go. This is it. Final battle. Fucking terrified. Oh. I never melt. I fight in here too. Okay. You never melt ice. here matey my rival <laughs> is it I want to make this a good playthrough matey here we go and then after this I'm good any second now ah there you are Joey you're such a fucking geek you want to you ready to battle between champions heck yeah all well, the folks here are really ready to watch word got around I guess and out of every single person gathered here, I'm the most excited by a mile. Oh my gosh, everyone's watching. The stage is set. It's my all out power versus your strength in full fruition. Let's see who comes out on top. Here we go. Rob Battle 6, the finale against two champions. First champion, Nimona of the Paldaren region, my rival from the beginning of the game. She has a mixed team. Let's do it. We are challenged by champion, Nimona. Let's go. Come on, Tizzy. We got this. 
no, 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 no. Finally, the thing I've been waiting for this time. For our greatest battle of all to begin. Let's do it. Alright, she starts off with a locking rock, midday form, at level 65, pure rock type with sand rush ability, double the speed in the sand. Or increase evasiveness by one in the sand, right? Is it? Yeah, increase it. No, yeah, double speed in the sand, yep. Rock moves Excel Rock, Drill Run, Stone Edge, and Stealth Rock. Alright, Tizzy. Flower Trick. It goes like a rock, one down, five to go. That's it, I knew you could do it. I think I helped you teach your type matchups, and now you use them to put the hurt on me. A critical hit? A, a critical moment? That goes beyond luck. You got some kind of gift. I'm a professional master, Pokemon Master Clown now. What? Okay, I did not expect this. Alright, next up is her Pramod. At level 65, electric fighting type with Votozord ability, so it gets electric immunity and raises the HP of hit by electric type move. Or increases next electric type hit by 1.5 extra damage. Rocket moves double shock, close combat, ice punch, and quick attack. So for an ice punch here? What? Alright, I'm gonna actually scout here just in case. Oh, close combat, cause I'm part dark. Oh, hell no. Okay, it's going for close combat. Alright, hold on. Alright, let me look at my team again. Your armor? I didn't expect this to come out this early. Fuck. Alright, thank you, Tizzy. Oh, an armor. I know you can do it. Is it gonna be neutral? That does a lot for no reason. What well, did a lot for no reason? Alright, fake out. That did a lot for no reason. I am scouting. Double shock? That's an electric move. I'm scared. Do I chance going to Magna here? I'm so terrified to go into Magna. If, if she pro plays me and goes for close combat, that's gonna do a lot of damage. Um, what's my defense oh. anyway? I am bulky though. Fuck. And it outspeeds too. Fuck. If, I, uh, if she KOs me, then... Well, it's the final battle anyway, so... I have to win this. I can't lose this battle. Armor... Alright, if I lose armor here... I get a free switch in. Is Tizzy faster than Pramat? I gotta see this. Meow Scarado. Your base speed is 123. And then Pramat... Is 105? My gosh, I think it's pretty fast. Alright, well, I definitely I'll speed it. Yeah, I definitely I'll speed it. Uh, wait, what's my nature? Just in case. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely I'll speed in it. I'm just scared. I don't know what it's gonna go for. I'm scared. Wait, 
Would it go for double shock again? Or will it go for close combat? It wouldn't go for close combat. Why, why would it? Because it'll keep going minus one defense, special defense. So it wants to go for double shock. And now if it does go for double shock, I forgot, it'll lose its fighting type and only become electric, right? Or it loses electric type in. What does double shock do? Okay, it loses the electric type in. Okay, I knew it. So this becomes a pure fighting type. That thing is fast though. Alright, this is kind of stupid. I'm gone. Yep, never double protect. Double shot. Fuck! I lost armor for no reason. Fucker! Sorry, armor. Uh, that's a good question. Um, if you're, if you're on, you want to play COD? Man, I'm just chilling here, laying down in the bed. Oh, okay. I got nothing better to do. Damn. All right. I'll play for. I'll play for a bit and then go to bed. All right. Ah, <sighs> fifteen deaths. Oh man. Alright. Alright, I know Tizzy L speeds. I know Tizzy L speeds. Tizzy, I need you. I started a Pokemon who saved my run. We have a special bond. That will never be broken. Without the Trestle because it's an important battle. Alright, Tizzy. Please. We have to avenge armor. I lose my Dark Typing. It's neutral. A stab with the Miracle Seed. And a crit. There goes Pramat. Two down, four to go. A third of a team defeated. I'm so sorry, armor. Oh, damn. Okay, okay, okay. Uh -huh. Next up is a Gudra, level 65. Pure Dragon type with Sap Sippers ability. Oh, okay, that's why. It'll get plus one attack if hit by a Grass type move. Rock moves, Dragon Pulse, Muddy Water, Ice Beam, and Sludge Bomb. Well, we know we outspeed it. So I'm going for the... Some chip damage for U-turn. All right, Achu, we need you. Stand by for battle. Using an ice beam? What a clown. Okay, now speed. That's interesting. Oh, no. Let's go, Achu. He was Gujra. Three down, three to go. Half her team defeated. And next up is her Orthworm. At level 65, pure steel type for Earth Eater's ability. It gets ground immunity and if hit by a ground type move, it will recover HP instead. Rock moves Iron Tail, Body Press, Earthquake, and Rock Blast. Okay, that's a good question. What would it go for then? Alright, on an Ice type, right? What would it want? What would it want to go for? Not earthquake. Body slam? I mean body press? Iron tail or rock blast? And I don't think I'll speed it. Uh, Bear Tick is... A speed is 50. Yeah, I'm not speeding that. Hell no. And Orthworm is 65. 
So it is a little bit faster. Yeah, okay. I don't know what it would go for. Iron Tail? I'm scared if it goes for Body Press. Oh wait, my answer was Vader. Alright, well, Iron Tail... It's not gonna go for Earthquake, no matter what. And Invader outspeeds it. Vader, I'm, we need you, matey. Oh, it's the final battle! Iron Tail, let's go! PJ, we did it! I took the right chance there. Flamethrower, baby. Now, Speed Invader. Here goes Orthworm. Four down, two to go. Two thirds of her team defeated. Next up is her the Dun Next up is her the Dun Spars. At level 65, pure normal type with serene grace ability to have an increased effect of moves that have a secondary effect, like flamethrower can can burn. Rock moves hyper drill, drill run, dragon rush, and coil. Oh damn. Um. Try noble roar this thing. I am. Alright, yeah, minus one. It's going for coil? Oh hell no. Alright, you're a neutral attack now. Alright, now it's trying to set up on me. Okay, this is not good. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna go for the stab flames over here. Not afraid of you. How do you like my real hard hits? Man, it feels good to finally let loose. Huh, you don't say. Flamethrower, baby. There goes the Dunsparce. Five down, one to go. It's our champion theme music, too. It's all down to this, my last Pokemon. We're gonna fight with everything we've got. Next up is her starter. Her ace, her Kukwavo, level 66. Water fighting type with Torrent ability to increase his water temples by 50% if it's HP 30% and below with a terror type of water, so it'll lose its fighting type. Rock moves Aqua Step, Brick Break, Air Lace, and Ice Spinner. She will have the starter that is weak in a new type advantage. Alright. Well, we know without speeds, and I'm taking a wild hypothesis. Hypothesis, I can't talk. Educated guess that's gonna go for a water move here. So let's swap. And I hope I'm right. Aquaman, we need you. Stand by for battle. Shine bl blazingly bright, my greatest treasure. Uh oh. Yeah, when a, when a trainer trestalizes their Pokemon, that means that Pokemon comes out last, no matter what. Get ready to see how strong Kukwavo has grown since the day we all met. Please go for Aqua Step. Get pro played! <laughs> oh, fucking sweaty goon! Okay. Alright, what would it go for on a water type? Is it gonna go for Brick Break or Aerial Ace? What would it go for? Brick Break or Aerial Ace? Let's protect and find out. Brick Break. Okay. Going for a brick break here. 
I'm gonna go for a charm then. Okay, minus two now. No, 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 no. All right, Burk Burk is fine. Yeah, minus four now. Yeah, minus six. <laughs> I'm nasty. I'm fucking nasty. Oh. I I lose my uh dark type in. If I go into Tizzy? There's no reflect though, Joey. But it's at minus six. Alright, I have I have U-turn just in case I need to get the heck out of here. Let's see how much it does, I'm curious. Thank you, Aquaman. Let's go Tizzy. It does nothing. This is it. Starter versus starter. Tizzy, end this battle for everyone watching. There goes Quaquavel. Six down. No more to go. That's it. I can do it. So just like Director Clavel, Namona is the same, but she has a uh, starter that's weakened her type of damage. She does the dab. For PJ. You. You did it! This is legit incredible. You're the strongest out of out there, Joey. Thank you. I try. I mean you knocked me flat, I was giving you absolutely everything I had. Everything I I Ha 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 ha! I'm a Joker fan. Oh man, Pokemon Battle, am I right? So much better, so much more fun than I ever knew. Thanks for that incredible match. You beat me fair and square. That's it. Ladies and gentlemen, another playthrough completed. Let's give ourselves a minute and have a, another quick battle before round two. <laughs> Which poker should I bring out this time? Decision, decision. Victory Road completed. Alright. Oh, let's get the pressing going. Uh, technically speaking, this is the post game. If I want to do it, area zero. But I always have my playthroughs here. It, well, technically speaking, you win or lose. Well, you win if you enter the Hall of Fame. Since there is no Hall of Fame technically in this game, um, I don't count the champion, Gita, as the final battle. I count when you legitimately complete all 18 badges by doing Victory Road. Uh, Team Starfall, and uh, what was the other one called? Uh, Path to Legends. Once you complete all three of those, and it says as we saw, complete, we're done. Alright, so that is part 56 versus Namona 6 in the final battle. And we lost armor. 
My female Haruyama. I had, I had to do it. It was unfortunate. I had no safe switching, which is sad for me. Um, it really sucks. All right, guys, I'm gonna give you guys a quick team recap of my beautiful Sexicon team and the final team recap of my Let's Play of Pokemon Scarlet Viewer's Choice. It was a fantastic playthrough with all of you guys. Night number 16. We're done. Here we go. Um. Yeah, do it. First up we have my starter Pokemon. The boss has started this run and this beautiful, sexy playthrough. Tizzy, the male Meowskarada, level 66. Grass Dark type with a type of Grass with the Miracle Seed. Next up we have Magnet, the Magnazona, level 66 as well. Electric Seal type with a type of Steel with the Light Clay. Next up we have Vader, the male Pyro, level 66 as well. Fire Normal type with a type of Fire with the Charcoal. Next up we have Aquaman, the male Vaporeon, level 65, pure water type, retired type of water with the Mystic Water. Next up we have Achu, the male Bear Tick, level 63, pure ice type, retired type of ice with the Nevermelt Ice. And last one is we have Armor, the female Hariyama, level 63, pure fighting type, retired type of fighting with the Black Belt. So we have 15 deaths. Eight badges, five Titans defeated, five Team Star bases cleared out, level cap 61. On my first attempt for viewer's choice. We did it, guys. What a playthrough. I want to give a special thanks to everyone who made this playthrough possible. Especially all of you at the beginning, helping me choose my team. And it was fun. Um, we're going to be working on uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. Because we're DX fans. Um, and because I love playing that game. And I haven't played it in a while. So it's going to feel good playing again. Um, I'm going to think of the next Hardcore Nuzlocke. Um, I have a couple games in mind. Um, I have either... Yellow version. Heart Gold. Emerald. Platinum. Those are the four for now. Uh, we're going to be doing Let's Go Eevee with Izzy. We have, of course, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, as I said as well. So that's six games. This is all for this duration of the year, I should say. Um, my goal is to get one every month, if possible. Two, if anything, depending on how short or long the playthroughs are. And how many times I play, of course. And, uh... Yeah, that was a fun playthrough. Um, thank you to everyone. I have to give a shout out to everyone. I know I'm going to forget people's names. That's why I'm going to say everyone instead. You guys made this playthrough possible. And it was fun. Um, night number 16, part 50 was Pokemon League. Well, we had to finish it. Uh, I fought Hassel, defeated Hassel, and Champion Gita of the Elite Four in the Pokemon League and the Champion. Part 51 was preparing for Arvin. Which leads to part 52 versus Arvin. And I lost Pepe Le Pew, my male skunk tank, by me being foolish. Part 53 was preparing for Director Clavel, which is, leads into part 54 versus Director Clavel. And I lost Chicken, my female town flame, by fooling around again and being foolish. Part 55 was versus Penny. Part 56 was versus Nimona 6. And I lost Armor, my female Hariyama, due to me being foolish again. So, oh, yeah, that's that. Alright, I got a timestamp so I don't forget. Um, with PJ at ringside, and it was a fun playthrough. Um, so, that's it. I'm gonna figure out the next playthrough. I'm leaning more towards on Emerald or Platinum first. But I don't know yet. I, I, need, to, I need to come up with a plan. But I will update you guys once I know what I'm going to do. Might have another uh, voting session on Twitter because I don't have enough people. Um, 
So I might be better doing that. I don't know yet. But yeah. Anything I forgot to mention, I will put in the description below. This is the finale, I should say. Part 16, night number 16. Um, let's play a Pokemon Scarlet Viewer's Choice Hardcore Nuzlocke game for you guys. What a fantastic run. Um, it's always fun playing Gen 9 because you're open to countless possibilities. And because it was Viewer's Choice, I decided to catch any Pokemon in my way. Because you guys were able to pick at any given time. Let me just swap members. So, um, I also did a Poldaren run too, which was only Gen 9 Pokemon. That was fun. Um, but yeah, for now we're good, and uh, that concludes the playthrough. And I dedicate the entire stream to all the people that we've lost in the month of January. We did it. A big W for everyone. And hopefully the next playthrough, I will see you guys there. Please gotta take care of all the people and the animals in heaven for me as well. Hope I did my best to make everyone happy, smile, laugh, proud with my ability. I salute everyone. It was fun. I have my Izzy, my good luck charm, my EP hat, you know, because she's always with me. <sighs> it was fun. I gotta catch my breath for a little bit because I'm a weekend fan. And, uh, that was some scary battles. Alright, guys, I'm gonna timestamp and, um, keep the stream going. Right. Um. Uh, yeah, that's it. All right. Uh, let me uh take one more talk. I get scared. All right, that's it. Did it. Game is done. All right, let me switch screens and all that good stuff. I will be right back, everyone. Have to switch our goggles, that's why. Oh man. Wow, that was fun. Oh man. I love Pokemon. This Sorry guys if it's if it lags or shuts off. A fuck? Looked in this one, why isn't it showing up? Oh, what the hell? Uh, hello game? Oh shit, I, I put the wrong one? 